a short guide on the taxation of supporters' community mutual societies. The information in this video is intended as a general overview of the corporation tax treatment of supporters' community mutuals and is in no way a definitive guide. General Trading Income Community benefit societies are treated as a corporate entity for tax purposes and as a general rule they are normally liable to corporation tax in respect of their profits or surplus computed in accordance with normal rules applicable for companies. The only time that trading income will be exempt from corporation tax is to the extent that it is deemed to be mutual trading. Mutual trading income if the trust is trading in such a way that its members and its customers are the same persons, the trade for tax purposes yields no profit or gains and therefore there will be no assessment to tax. In order that the trust falls within this exemption, there has to be the necessary element of mutuality. In particular, it's essential that the profits should be capable of coming back at some time and in some form to the person to whom the goods were sold or the services rendered. Types of income here are some of the most likely types of income that supporters community mutual may receive and the relevant taxation treatment. Interest. All interest received is chargeable to corporation tax and must be reported on a corporation tax return. Sales. This is likely to constitute trading and as a general rule, the profit on sales, income less allowable deductions to members and non-members will be taxable. Donations. Donations of money are not taxable. In addition, the sale of donated goods, providing the goods have not been significantly changed before the sale, also not liable to corporation tax. Fundraising. Fundraising for a charity generally falls outside the scope of corporation tax by virtue of an inland revenue concession. However, it is unlikely that supporters community mutual will fall within this concession. Expenses. Day-to-day -day running expenses, usually met from members' subscriptions, are not taken into account when calculating the corporation tax liability. Expenses incurred in earning a profit from trading are allowable deductions for taxation purposes. Trading losses Supporters' community mutuals will be granted special treatment in respect of the offset of tax losses. Share and loan payments Share interest or loan interest will not be treated as a distribution providing the trust makes a return to the inland revenue within three months of the end of an accounting period, giving the names and addresses of all persons to whom share or loan interest amounting to more than £15 has been paid without the deduction of tax. Value added tax, VAT. This area of VAT is extremely complex and as such we will provide an overview in a separate video. So that's it. Trusts and Tax For more training resources for your supporters trust or community owned club visit supporters-direct.org and register for our hub today.